Hello, 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 guys! Welcome to my new generation back video, guys. The Furina is finally coming. The Hydro Archon, my favorite character, is coming in patch 4.2. Dude, Miho just announced her on Twitter. Officially announced on Twitter that she is coming in patch 4.2. So we are gonna talk about her elemental skill, her element burst, passive talents, her constellation, everything that is she is the broken character that we are waiting for, and finally she is coming. So stay tuned till the end, guys. Guys, she is gonna be the hydro element, of course, the fire character, of course, but she wields the sword. We're gonna get the first sword character, sword high uh, archon, sorry, sword archon in the game. And guys, don't think that she's being a sword character is gonna be weak. No, guys, she is gonna be better and stronger than the Raiden Shogun. For me, the strongest Archon in the game is the Raiden Shogun in terms of being a DPS, sub DPS, or being a proper support character. Raiden Shogun is the best Archon in the game, but I think Furina is gonna beat the Raiden Shogun hands down. Furina, first of all, heals you, Furina gives you buffs, a lot of buffs, and third thing, Furina will perform damage on the field better better than your any hydro character fourth thing furina is gonna be the best hydro applicator in the game so she is a full pack character that we are waiting for you can use her in any teams with the c note in the hyper bloom team in the bloom team in the melt team Mel uh, sorry in the vaporized team in the frozen team anywhere you want her you can use her why the elemental skill having the 30 second duration it's gonna be the similar not the same similar to what yelen and shinkyu burst will do yelen and shinkyu bur uh, burst simply perform some sword some knives when you do the normal attack or the charge attack the so same things similar things gonna happen with the furina's elemental skill when you do the normal attack when your active character do the normal attack or the charge attack their pets the furina's pets gonna deal the damage they're gonna perform some hydro attack and they're gonna deal the damage this gonna stays for 30 seconds because the pets attacks have some intervals like two to three second intervals of course they're not gonna rapidly or continuously attack someone uh, and the duration is 30 seconds every pet has an individual damage multiplied that's also a thing everything is scaled on the hp percentage purina's whole kit is scaled on the hp percentage and beside dealing the damage she also gonna buff you in the elemental skill also now so let's talk about the elemental burst guys okay now let's talk about the elemental burst in the elemental burst when you activate the elemental burst uh, for this deals the hydro aoe hydro damage and she also summons some uh, some of her pet in the elemental burst also the pets are similar to what you seen in the elemental skill but they just appear for the few seconds and then disappears after dealing the damage furina's elemental burst stays for 18 seconds and the cooldown is also 18 seconds the energy cost for the elemental burst is 70 pretty low and guys furina gains some fanfare points in her elemental burst fanfare points is gonna be very important because fanfare points is gonna give her and all party members dam damage bonus and the healing bonus also yes furina can gain a damage bonus and a healing bonus in her elemental burst not only for uh, only for her but for whole for whole team like i guess for the all party nearby party members so how is gonna ga gain the fanfare points like what's the process of gaining the fanfare points when you activate the elemental burst of furina instantly you're gonna gain the 450 fanfare, fanfare points uh, further if you want to gain more fanfare points when you're active or nearby party members incre uh, hps increase or decrease they will grant furina one fair point based on the percentage by which their max hp changed you're understanding the amount of decreasing or increasing your nearby party members is getting on the basis of that your furina will gain one point for you know each percentages on the basis of the percentages of the by which their max career hps change i don't know how this is going to happen but in the simple words when your nearby party members not the active character but near uh, the sleeping characters nearby party members will increase or decrease their hp so in that way furina will gain additional fanfare points and more fanfare points for dealing the more damage and getting the more healing bonus
story is not ended here guys the story is still going on the passive talents are very very good like literally when you're at one of the passive talents just heals your nearby party member if your active characters is getting healed by some other healer not the forina so for the next four seconds your nearby party member is gonna get healed by forina oof and the second passive talent will just give you more more damage more damage to your elemental skill the furina's elemental skill and second will give you more the more uh, healing powers like your active character heals faster like i don't know how this is gonna work but your active character is gonna heal faster and your <laughs> Elemental scale of Furina. Furina's elemental scale getting more damage and second passive talent of Furina. Guys, the Furina is gonna be the strongest character in the game. I think she will gonna break the game. This is uh, uh, all things coming from the beta. This can be changed in the future like the percentage, like the duration, the CD, the energy cost, the workings. They can change anything now because that's what the beta is for beta is for testing and they're testing the characters but for now what we are looking at it's just looking so good i'm very very excited about this character like ah this, she's gonna be very very good in the game so i hope guys you'll you'll get understand like i tried my best explaining the whole kit of forina if you still have any question you can ask me in the comment guys come on like this video share this video with a friend or guys if you want to see more Genshin Lady videos in the future, guys, subscribe to my channel, yeah, come on. And we'll meet in the next videos, guys. Till then, bye-bye, take care.